Hi everybody, today's video will be about uh, uh, fixing of the problem with the with the speed of the fan, air conditioning fan. Uh, this video is about uh, air conditioning version which has this control panel. Uh, it has nothing to do with the, with the knob control panel which is uh, in the cars without air conditioning. So, uh, the problem looks like that uh, you turn the uh, you turn the, the interior fan on and uh, it randomly stops working or uh, variating with the speed and or, or and any other uh, any other problems. So if this happens, this thing is to play is to blame. It's placed relatively deep inside the center console but not that much you can see this opening I have removed the fan of course and there is opening here just here you can you can see here is opening and this connector is disconnected from this unit so the unit is placed there something like something like something like this there it is uh, it is some latch or or um, it just sits in the opening and on the opposite side there is one screw these screws are like this it's uh, hex 6 mm or 6.5 mm or torx number 15 so to this to this mount the cooling fan or well, not cooling fan but air conditioning fan or heating fan uh, you must take out a few screws it's the same uh, like this and there is first, second, third, fourth, once more, first, second, third, fourth, probably four, or only four of them, one, two, yes, it looks like three, four, uh, it's a little bit problematic to take out uh, particularly this one just it just because it is hidden hidden behind the, behind some uh, pillar around here and probably there is one more right, right around here not not here but here and this one right here not this, but there is a little bit up, upper. Now you can see it. It's here, and there is a hole in this uh, in this uh, part. And through this hole, you can you can push some tool and release it. So it's pretty difficult. And uh, but but it's possible to make it so let's remove cooling fan and then you will find one small screw around somewhere around here it is placed like i will take that old one it is placed like this and the screw is around here you can you can feel it with your finger also i strongly recommend to take uh, water with some with some um, deep degreasing or, or or cleaning agent and clean everything around here all the flaps just how far you will get with your hand there is opening for the uh, for the evap evaporator 
of the air conditioning so you can clean th those parts perfectly also the, the propeller of the fan you can see this is cleaned properly but uh, when you take this out you will get uh, very black dirt sticked on, on it and probably some remains are still here but it is impos almost impossible to clean so be careful for the balancing weights which is here and uh, basically you can take the motor out by pressing these rubber these rubber some kind of some kind of latches or I don't know the exact English term and also by pushing this connector inside just push it inside with the pliers or anything and motor will go out and you can clean the motor with the petrol uh, carefully uh, put uh, some grease on the on its bearings and it should turn freely Caref be careful for these these uh, coils noise uh, noise suppressing coils which are placed in the in, in some kind of plastic holders first and second it goes to the motor brushes and you can see how it should look like Okay, I'm sorry for small amount of light, but probably I will take this. Okay, so I have tried to repair it uh, and uh, together with my electronic specialist friend and, uh, and we have just, uh, I cannot find it, but doesn't matter, uh, this is some kind of uh, protective rubber or something like silicone and the root cause of the almost impossible to repair it is that uh, this is removable by probably mix of acetone and petrol and uh, every f uh, each and every solvent and you must uh, pour it down and let it one week to weaken the structure of it and then with the with the with the hard wire brush uh, you can uh, partially uh, remove this but uh, you know it's it's not worth it but just because this is f f some 20 or 25 euros or th maximum 30 euros so it's a very common problem or on a2s and uh, almost everybody and every, each and every A2 does have this problem I will try to uh, I will try to uh, discover uh, how it is operated what kind of signal is uh, is driving it and and uh, simply just another another task for me the removal of the glove box is pretty simple there are one two third screw is underneath the coin holder in here and uh, one of or, or two of them are uh, below this so it's pretty simple fan is pretty complicated but still it is possible to make so so clean this I will probably clean it once more with, with the clean water and to, to have it completely clean. Uh, you can also replace your filter, air filter. Uh, I didn't have the new one but uh, I used compressed air to, to clean it. It was not old. This color is regular, it is uh, active charcoal. So you can see. Air filter. <laughs> 